Good evening and welcome back to RimWorld, I'm Modi Operandis, we're back at our colony of lobsters den. Even the lobsters are gone and forgotten, for the most part here. Uh, we have the four, the fearsome four here, back once more here, and trying to get this place built. Oh, uh, man. Of all the things we need to do around here, this is the one that's bugging me so much here. Uh, we have so much food now, though. We have so much food. I need to set up some jobs here to harvest some trees here so we have wood to make fires and stuff. Let's just, let's just do all of it. And let's also see if there's any, any, uh, berries we can harvest around here for some other cheap food. Uh, within reason, without going too far away from the base here. There we go. Um, let's see what people's work is set up for right now. Cut plants should be number one. Uh, constructing's number one. And it's like, everything's a priority right now. Everything's a priority. We're getting by without medicine just fine, it looks like, for now. Just cutting the berries down. Okay, so what we'll do then is actually build a, uh, a fire in here. Oh, we really gotta get this building done. That's so, it would solve so many problems um, if we get this built. Just waiting for that to happen. But it's taking forever because we don't have materials. We have no building materials and there's not as much steel as I thought there would be. So uh, yeah, we need to deconstruct some things. And I might have to just force some things to happen here. Okay, what? how tired are you? You're not tired enough, buddy. Get over here and deconstruct something. Yeah, deconstruct some slate walls. We can use this to build the thing. That's four. How bad are you off now? Not quite yet. Not quite yet. I might just change the regime to like only sleeping like three hours a night or something like that because I need them to do more work. All right, that gets us closer. That's four, 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 that's 16. I'm thinking we need like 20 or so. Oh, he fell asleep, okay. He's that tired, really? Oh, we don't have any bed stuff for anybody, that's why. Oh, yeah, that's right. Okay, so one thing we do have now is I added in a couple mods at the behest of uh, Tim Redford in the comments actually suggested these to me, so thank you, Tim. Uh, so what he suggested is we add in the camping mod because it's a good fit for our, uh, our gameplay right here. What this does is it adds in, first of all, it adds in the ability for us to camp rather than making a colony. If we find a spot we want to go and just guess, do uh, some searching for food and that kind of thing, we don't have to make a whole camp for us to go check that out. What we'll do is just make a uh, camp, or a whole colony for us to check that out. We'll just make a camp and we can check it out and not like stay there for long term or anything like that. Kind of a short term kind of deal. Hunt and that kind of thing. What it also adds in is a uh, butchering spot, so you don't have to worry about making a butchering table. Uh, we don't need that right now because we already have the butchering table, but it's there. Um, so you can butcher without making the butchering table. You can basically do everything you need to do without bringing a whole lot of stuff with you. So that's what the camping mod brings in, or make camp or something like that. Um, but what this other mod is, a camping stuff mod made by the same person, uh, it adds in stuff like the sleeping bags. And what these are are little things that can be rolled up and take with you. They, they don't weigh as much as beds do. So you can have the same beds with you all the time. You carry them with you. You don't have to worry about uh, leaving stuff behind. Would be great for our no bad playthrough. Assuming we survive the area that we're in right now with everyone sleeping outdoors and that kind of thing. It doesn't look likely. Kuro is in tough, tough shape here still. Got malnutrition. Um, We need meal source. Yeah, I agree. We need a fire. And then once that happens, we're good. Somebody's got four work left on it. Please, somebody just do it. Um, I'm gonna set up sleeping spots in here. Kuro's actually taking up two sleeping spots at the moment, by the way. Um, let's get these things built. Get these things built quick and then you can sleep. Okay, she's gonna go sleep there. Larson can work on it, I think. Let's see, what is it working on? Sleeping, good. Sleeping, good. Okay, so make these things so that we have some spots to sleep. I'm gonna delete this place here. And now people can claim their own sleeping bags here. And once Sloane wakes up, he can go sleep in a bed if he still wants to. And Sarah can go sleep in a bed if she still wants to. Oh, good, good, good. Feed, feed some people to the sick people. Feed some, feed, some, feed some people to the sick people. Feed some food to the sick people. Jeez. Uh, all right, so let's cancel these walls here. Put in some slate walls. We should have almost enough. Let's see, 10, 15. 20, 25, 30. So we need 30, we have 23 right now. So if we take these other two down, we probably will make it. Sloan's on it. And Larson's gonna help out, grab those things, and take them all with us. And that's gonna get us real close. 
we might have enough limestone to finish it off. Finally, we got this thing done. And this will help the heat, it'll help the moods, it'll help everything. People won't be happy about sharing bedrooms or anything like that, but it'll it'll do for now. Uh, deconstructing sandstone wall. You know what, actually, just forget that for now. I have all the walls we need now, um, I think. I don't think we need to build anything else. So, uh, forget that for now. If it's steel, maybe, but um, let's cancel this. Let's uh, make it in the limestone, I guess. Structure, actually, let's go build copy. Right there, do it. Got enough here? You got seven, perfect. Do one more thing, put the roof on it. We'll be have a nice, warm building for our people to hang out in. Everyone will be happy. What are we missing here? Mega slot leather, okay, we don't have enough in the area. Uh, what do we have over here? Where is it? It was over here, wasn't it? Yeah. We have 41 caribou leather. Okay, so let's cancel this. Let's uh, switch that to uh, furniture, caribou leather. We have enough for that one. Perfect. Now, I want people to make some meals here, so I'm gonna put them on billing. And I think that we need the kibble for, uh, we need the kibble for um, taming animals. We want to tame those caribou we saw last time. Or we can kill them for food. I mean, either way. Psychic Soothe is ending. Oh, that's gonna be unfortunate. Uh, he made the kibble, okay. We should also, because we have berries now, we can make pemmican also. And yeah, let's do that too, because that'll, that'll last longer. Uh, once it starts getting warmer out here, it travels nicely. Uh, people carry it with them. Um, cool, so this is nice and warm in here now. 14, 20 degrees rather. Awesome. Uh, let's do a table in here. Just, I mean, I know this isn't like really about moving on at the moment. I just want people to stop eating off the ground and getting mad about it. We need, or we need to protect the moods a lot here because, I mean, the major break risks are going to be a big problem here if it happens. And it could happen pretty easily. Uh, people should be able to move this stuff in indoors now. See what this stuff. Move it inside. Oh, I didn't. I didn't make a. Uh, that's why uh, I didn't zone this area yet. So expand the roof area here, like so. Put a roof on that, and that way, uh, stuff won't deteriorate when we throw it in there. And make it some pemmican. Awesome. I like it. I like it a lot. So then the other thing we need to do, the other thing we can do with this new mod, is we can actually make tents. And this will help us long term too. So we're going to spend a little more time here than I wanted to. But we're going to try to make a tent or two with the resources we have available. Um, I don't know if we'll find anything. But what we can do, if we go production and build a hand tailoring workbench. Bad temperature, really? Let's also put in uh, furniture, some torch lamps in here so people aren't mad at the dark. You know, people get mad at the dark. Um, cargo pods, what do we got today? Oh my god, look at that! That'll certainly help out. Can I have you haul these things? All the medicine in, bud. We need that. We need it to be, co be covered, too. So that it doesn't go bad. And then we'll have somebody work on this ceiling here, too, so it doesn't go bad, either. I want this roof done today, pronto, please. Let's cover up the food and cover up the, not the consume, I want to build. All right, micro, a little micromanagement, that's fine. We still need one bed. Is Crow taking up two? No, he's not. Sloan has got a bed still. All right, good. Sloan, where are you going? Only caribou meat, okay, cool. Oh, uh, what are you doing, Sloan? Relax socially, okay. Where is our caribou leather situation here? We need 30. I guess cooking is the bigger priority here. And we should not have to move out of the room for cooking uh, orders. Because we don't have a lot of uh, meals right now. We'll set up a couple of things in here. Uh, we'll say clear all meals only. Highest priority. Now he's not running out of the room constantly to drop off meals. Sounds like a good idea, right? And whoever gets up first, I'll have them build the bed. Uh, let's see. We've been here for a while. Curl thinks should be named the community. Uh, we're not going to name this place. I guess Andon. Curl can call it whatever he wants. Doesn't mean we have to follow it. Okay, so Lone's got a bed. Come on, just build this last thing here. Please, you guys would be so much happier if you built it. You guys would be so much happier indoors here. Alright, good. 
Everybody's happy now. Going to be 40 degrees indoors here now. Be fantastic. Nice and warm. Nice and toasty. People will love it. And hey, a caravan. I don't think we have anything to trade with, but hey, something maybe. I don't think we even have uh, silver to trade with at the moment. Well, let's get the stuff added to, uh, let's go orders, uh, zone area, stockpile. Put this as a stockpile that we have something to trade with here. Who's our best social? Everyone's a zero. Okay. They're incapable. Everyone else is a zero. Good luck, Sayuri. Good luck. Can you talk to these people and uh, see what they're trading? Are they bringing, they're coming over to us. Let's wait for them then. So we got food poisoning from a simple meal because no one knows how to cook anymore. That's fine. Can someone make a thing here? Why is Kuro still in bed? Double bites, weakened, heat stroke. Heat stroke? Is it that hot in here? Oh, maybe it is. We got the camp stove and everything like that in here. I mean, I guess it could be too hot. Doesn't take much. Just go stand outside for a minute, buddy. Do that, please. And then uh, we need somebody like Kuro to go trade with these guys. All right, your negotiator Kuro cannot talk properly because of poor health. This will affect trade prices. Okay, cancel. Um, Larson, can you just do a quick here? All right, there we go. Uh, let's. Trade off. Oh god, we have so many components that we can't do anything with. Um, an elephant. Oh, damn, we're never gonna be able to afford that. Uh, let's sell off some of the clothing that we don't need anymore. For some cash. Synthra jacket sells for that much. Yeah, we'll get rid of that. Sure. Anything else we can buy from these guys that we might want for now, though? They don't have meals we can buy buy from them, which would be optimally what we need the most of. Um, a mega screen television with no electricity. How about that? Uh, let's keep the jacket then. We don't need that much cash. Yeah, they have so much money though. Debating. Um, hmm. Well, what's an alpha beaver going to do for us? Not much. We can't really afford to feed it either. Don't want to get plasteel. Can't do anything with that. Man, this guy doesn't have anything we really want. A good personal shield will be too expensive. What I'd love is someone to help us do work. That's what I'd love. He doesn't even have medicine for sale. You know what? We're just going to sell off what we have. Like these little things like this. And that's about it. That's all we can do, I think, really. Um, That's all we can do with this. Because... Yeah, they got nothing else we want. Nothing else we want. All right, it's gonna have to do. And now I would love someone to freaking work on this thing. Come on, Larson. I mean, take a make break from uh, these materials, really? Caribou leather. 15, where happened to the other caribou leather? Okay, well, that's why it's not getting built, I guess. Thought we had enough. Unless it deteriorated because it was outside. Squirrel skin. Timberwolf skin. Who's our animal tamer? Sloan. Where's Sloan? Taking kill. Oh, he's going to go do it. He's going to go do it. Okay, good luck. Tame these animals. How good is he? It's a 10. It's possible. Or it's possibly set them off and uh, kills the colony. Failed. 6% chance of succeeding, I think it looks like. Okay. Well, he tried. He tried at least. Crow, how long are you going to stay in bed, buddy? Really? He's not going to leave bed. Okay. You can't be happy about that. Alright, well, we're getting some things done around here, at least now. The the sleeping bag thing, I wish we could figure out. This Kuro finally is fully healed. Awesome. Alright, cut down some more trees. 
Um, there we go. And then to make the tents, they'll be in the tailoring bench here. And the medium tent, for instance, it takes uh, 300 ingredients, 50 wood, okay? What does the small tent take? I don't know how much room this actually has in it. Take a look here quick. It takes 150 ingredients. That might be more likely. Um, let's do bills here quick. Can we do uh, information on these things? No, we can't. All right, that's too bad. I think a medium, I think small one's gonna be like just like a two-seater. We're gonna need at least two of those. It's gonna be 300 anyway, so I think we'll, we'll save up and get the uh, large one then. It's 400 ingredients. Can we get 400 ingredients? Maybe if we kill those those uh, deer over there. I think a big one would su be sufficient though. I mean, we don't have enough of uh, stuff to to make a bed with right now. Can we hunt some rabbits or something for the time being? Is there anything around here to hunt? Besides those guys we're trying to tame. It does still make sense to tame those. <gasps> Here we go. Here we go. Here's our answer solved. Orders. Hunt. All these things. And we'll tame the other two over here. Unless they're going to leave. Uh, let's see. Hunters have weapons. Make sure. Kuro is the main hunter. I think he might have lost his weapon. Let's see here quick. Kuro does not have weapon at the moment. Okay. Let's give him the sniper. 43. Okay. It's in the rain so we shouldn't leave it out there. Um, I would love to delete this stock while have you guys haul that stuff in too. What else we got around here right now? These are hauling in wood, okay. Caravan's leaving. I want this bow hauled in. Where'd it go? We just had it. Here it is. Haul this bow in because it's a good bow. It's a great bow. It's a great bow. 64% only now because it's deteriorating. All right, good job, guys. Good job. You gotta hit the broadside of a barn, unfortunately, and Kuro is asleep. Oh, because Kuro doesn't have a bed yet. Well, you know what? If you'd hit the side, if you'd been able to kill one of those things, you'd have a bed already. Well, wake up and kill these things. I mean, let's see how much rest you have. You're good now, buddy. Go do it. Which one are you trying to kill here? It's gonna bleed out in a second. Can we get a little closer? They're all gonna bleed out in a second here. Oh, Kuro, come on, man. All right, we need uh, another uh, we need another campfire set up for more food. Keep making meals. Let's actually set this as a uh, not medical. There, there we go. Now it should be fine. Even though it's not what we want, someone can go sleep in that bed now, finally. We don't need to have it as a medical bed. And someone should make that fire here. We need a joy source. Okay, let's put in a horseshoe thing. Oh, you got one. Okay. Yeah, if we can get caribou leather, we'll be good. We can make a tent with that? We'll be set, man. How much leather do we get from this guy? Let's find out. Well, enough to do the job here. 33 from that one. Plus, uh, okay, so like, you know, like 40 maybe? Yeah, hunt all of them. Really. Luckily, he's standing behind the tree, too, like, uh, some cover, covering fire. He might actually be hurting his accuracy standing behind that tree. Oh, good. Boomalopes. That will end our day really quickly. Uh, this would be great for Kuro to deal with those guys. Let's see, there's three of them. They, they travel pretty quickly. Let's wait for it and wait till you see the lights of their eyes. Kuro, I need you to start attacking them as soon as you can. There you go, one down. Now you can hit it. And now that it, now it counts, you can hit. 
Oh, don't let it get too close. Okay, run. Oh, it's getting too close. Okay, run away, run away. Sloan, come this way. Draw it, in, draw it in line of fire. Oh, nicely done. Kuro, can you fire at this thing? Keep your distance. Sloan, can you fire this thing too? Kill it so that they don't blow up and they don't uh, cause any problems here. Oh, he's up. He's up again. Can make a boomalob leather tent. That'd be amazing. All right, let's under after you guys. You guys go about your business. Uh, did they scare away the these guys? Okay, they didn't. Good. That's awesome. And they're gonna go. Uh, all wood. Okay. Yeah, get that wood out of the fire. That's a good idea. Larson's grabbing wood. Uh, cargo pods. Where we got here now? Oh, there's our, there's our, uh, there's our answer. There's our answer for, uh, making something here. We're getting a lot of stuff here. Were we able to carry all this? I don't even know. It's gonna be close. Um, we can have the big, we can have the big tent done. We got all that elk hide. If we can use two different kinds of material, we'll be set. I don't know if we can or not. That'll be the answer. If we can make two different kinds of material, uh, we will be all set, really. And over here we have chocolate bars. Oh my god. Oh, we are set on food now. Now, outdoors, it's not going to be freezing much longer, so we got to pay attention to that. Um, we'll need passive coolers eventually and that kind of thing. Indoors, it's quite hot, actually. Um, so we might want to consider that as well. Um, anybody, everybody good in here? Heat stroke. Yeah, we're spending too much time in the heat here. It is hot. It's hot in here. 30 degrees Celsius? That's pretty hot. Is it? Yeah, that's pretty hot. That's like 90. So we might have made it too warm in the house. I mean, it's a separate room for cooking then after this. The guys, team guys are on its own is enough. As far as that goes. Sayer's so going to haul elk hide. Awesome. Um, someone should tailor. I'm going to set somebody up for a one for tailoring. Actually, both these guys are up for a one for tailoring. This one gets done. I want this tent built so we can move on. And Sloan is starting a firing spree. Well, as long as it's not like near our base, yeah, it's fine. Go, go nuts. Go nuts, buddy. There's another one dead here. Not the one he's aiming at. Sloan's feeling better. Uh, let's, let's get some of these uh, fires taken care of, I guess, here now. Because they do have threatened to burn our base down. Well, maybe we'll just leave it. There's enough dirt around here that it can... It'll probably not matter. Extreme break risk for everybody. How do these beds do? Did we make these nicely? Normal, normal, body, and good. Nice. That's a good start. We can always make more and have nice beds for everybody. Um... There you go. It's right nice in range here for you. Don't miss it. Don't miss a shot. Kuro, come on. There you go, buddy. You're not gonna haul it? No empty graves. Oh, well, I mean, I guess... We just butcher it right away. That's why I'm not hauling it. Okay. Well. Causes your buddies to take an extra trip then. You know. When you do that. How are we doing on this elk hide here then? We have 225. We've got food poisoning. We don't have enough of anything yet. Burrow is going to relax outside. Watch the sunset. We didn't get 400 of anything. Um, it would take some doing, I think, to get 400. I don't think we can combine two different textiles together, unfortunately. So, do we make a small one instead, then? Let's 
Let's pick a small one instead. Let's see how it goes. Cargo pods. Wait, 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 wait. What do we got here? Oh, shells. Okay, we can sell those off to somebody, maybe. If we can't take those with us, that's fine. If we can get these guys tamed, that'd be amazing. The fire's getting pretty close to our stuff here, guys. I'm gonna wake up. I'm gonna wake up. Put out the fires. Looks like he used 7575 El Qaeda. Okay, so he used all the El Qaeda up. It's fine. As long as it's getting done. We have our first tent. Put somebody outside so they don't have to sleep in this, uh, in here, maybe? We'll see how this tent's gonna be. Okay, so you made a tent. And deployable tent is someplace. Oh, here it is. Here's a deployable tent right here. So, um. Deploy tent. A. So it's like not that big. It's, uh, rather small. But, um, you can fit two beds in there. That looks good. I like it. So that's the tent support there. I like it. This is this is the perfect nomad thing to have. And then we can put this the uh a bed in there. Um somebody's uh sleeping bag we can reinstall in there and they can have their own room. Might be a little cold right now, but I mean that might be fun. I don't know, I don't know if these stay warm or not. Two degrees inside, three degrees outside, about the same. Uh let's set it for who's got the worst problems here? Larson, maybe. You have your own room now. Congratulations. And we'll set up like a, a torch in there, and maybe that'll be warm enough. We'll see. Yeah, ten degrees. Okay. Yeah, that's not bad. That's probably probably pretty good for an indoor place. Actually, it's heating up pretty nicely. So one torch is enough to heat one of these things. I wonder if we're better off making four small tents rather than uh, one big tent. And a big tent might be the the goal for us down the road. But if we can get four small tents of various things here, I mean, we did 150 of something. 150 anything. And actually, in reality, we don't need four tents in the outset here. We could always get four tents later. Berserkers, okay, let's see, jump to it. What's he got on him? He's, he's going berserk, he's got the sniper rifle on and off. He's just gonna sit there twitching it on and off and scaring people away. I think he's not gonna actually fire anybody. Uh, you guys gotta make some meals here. Sorry, it's my fault. I, I agree, it's my fault. But, um, I am getting sick of you guys. We're letting this fire go out, first of all. Tend to the fire. Alright. We have two calls idle. Sayuri. Here's another tent. Hey, let's do it. Um... This is gonna be good. This is gonna be really cool when we finally, uh, when we finally, uh, use these in the world here. Oh, look, they're gonna be pretty, man. Okay. Let's get Sayuri her own place. And again, we'll put it in one, uh, torch. Should be plenty. Plenty of heat. Yeah, this is gonna be sweet. Make it really nice and easy. And then we can just tell it to. Deconstruct, I think. Oh, wait, let's go to this one. I think he has deconstruct here. Set, pack the tent. Yeah, that's all you gotta do. Um, Kuro is back to normal. Good, good, good. Oh, this is gonna be really cool, guys. This is gonna be really cool. I can't wait. This is such a good mod. Thank you so much for recommending it to, uh, to Tim. Um, very helpful. Very helpful. I think it's perfect, perfect fit for this series. And, uh, will keep us alive, I think, a little bit better. And we can be more mobile now, too. We can, we can travel faster. Uh, because we don't have to build things, we can do camping, we can do whatever we want in the future. So, should be pretty cool. But, uh, we have enough food to probably travel again. We have 754 food, raw food. We can just take that with us. I don't think we're gonna have to spend time making all these meals. We can just have raw food. People don't, don't, aren't that bothered by it, I think, in this tribe here. Are they, are they, they care about eating raw food? Eh, a little bit. But, um, yeah, I don't know. We don't have enough to make any more places. These things we can definitely take with us. Uh, we'll take the wood with us, we'll take the silver with us. As long as we have enough to carry all that stuff, otherwise we stay around till we can tame these things. These are the last two caribou. Um... Yeah, that would be, that would be the only thing I want to stick around here for, maybe. But I think, next episode, either way, we're gonna get going again. 
We'll be on the road once more with our new tents. Uh, we can put two people in these. We can make more as we go. Um, we'll just slowly collect a bunch of textiles and, and be able to make them very, very soon. Anyways, guys, that's going to do it for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. I uh, hope you enjoyed the series. I think the tent prospect of this is fantastic. Uh, it adds a whole other component to this, this uh, playthrough that I wasn't expecting and I'm really excited by. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time for more RimWorld. Have a good night.